This loss could stop any country, but this is not the Russian Federation. Valery Zaluzny, we must continue to inflict losses on the Russian occupiers until they give up their war against Ukraine. Valery Zaluzny, commander-in-chief of the armed forces of Ukraine, said this. Zaluzny noted that the bodies of Russian servicemen are piled up on the front, but the other side does not even try to take away the bodies of the servicemen. I already said once that this is one of my main mistakes. I believed that the war could be stopped with the losses we inflicted on the enemy even a year ago. Such losses can stop any country, but I understand that this is not the Russian Federation. Zaluzny added, every day they appear more and more, and unfortunately this is how the Russian Federation treats its people. It's quite hard to predict how many casualties are necessary to bring this to an end. I believe we must do this steadily inflict casualties on the Russian occupying forces until the war is over, until the enemy gives up fighting against our country. What's happening on the contact line is there are piles of bodies and no one is even bothering to take Russians away. More and more bodies appear there every day. Unfortunately, that's the Russian attitude towards its people, he said. The total combat losses of Russian troops between the 24th of February 2022 and 26th of December 2023 are estimated to be about 354,960 military personnel.